Hello. <clears throat> We'll just wait for some more people to come on. Hi guys. Hello. My cat's down here. Yes, I cut my hair. I tried to straighten it today. I don't know if it worked out very well. I used that Moroccan, Moroccan oil, or Moroccan, whatever it is. And it's, uh, hi Martine. Um, you put it on to, you know, kind of protect your hair. And it's got this really interesting smell. I kind of like it. Not going to lie. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Actually, while everyone is coming in, I'm actually going to start to do my... <clears throat> the base I'm just gonna put on my um my concealer and I'll do the rest of my face later so I'm, I'm gonna use my hi Andrea I'm gonna use my doll 10 stuff um so if you guys have any questions about doll 10 um I'm gonna use a lot of their stuff and then I'm going to use this Denera Danessa Merrick's Beauty. I'm really excited to try this. I have been like thinking about this all week. So I thought I'd save it for a live and see if I can get it right. I am hoping so, but uh, we will see. Oh, this is made from like surgical steel and oh, it feels so good right now on my eye. <laughs> So how is everybody today? Is it a better better night for people on a Wednesday night? I feel like I know they have their day cream on there, Andrea, and I'm not going to lie to you here. Grab it if you can. It is hands down now my number one day cream. And the first time you use it, you'll notice, you'll notice, like, it leaves your skin tingling a little bit. Like, nothing, like, horrendous or anything. But. Because I don't know if this is just, like, I don't know how these colors are. So, I do have, like, the Dalton Neutral palette. So, I'll use that as well. But I'm going to use, like, the blush, the lipstick, and the eye stuff for that. Um, I have to say, like, I don't know exactly who's using my code, but, uh, it's been used a lot lately and Dalton has noticed, so they might try and get me onto the PR list. We can't guarantee anything right now. But... Ooh. So, you've had a you in the U.S. then? Because... It, it, I know it is the American Thanksgiving, and here in Canada, we've already had ours. We have ours back in October, although it's funny. It was like, um, <clears throat> I was like, why is everyone talking about this being a short week? But yes, it is a short week, so um, yeah, that's awesome. Ah, uh, okay. So is it as rainy as what they say it is? I pulled everything out and I had it here, but I guess I misplaced something. I already am an ambassador for them, but I want to try and get on their PR list because then I wouldn't have to buy everything. <laughs> I mean, I don't mind buying it. Don't get me wrong. It's just that it would be nice to, to have a little bit more than that. Um, okay, so I guess I did pull it out and then I promptly put did not put it where I wanted it to be. 
So I might, oh, okay, you know what? 39 degrees. It's actually raining here in Ontario. Um, yes, it, it kind of is. Like, I don't mind buying their products. I love Dalton's products. And I really would like their brush set. But uh, things are a little tight for the, for the next little while anyway. Okay, so. Now that that's kind of prepped, I am going to use... Actually, where is it here? There it is. This, to set my under eye. Yeah, um, I was just outside and all the snow we have is gone. It was freezing cold yesterday. Like I had on a sweater and my winter coat and the winter coat that I have. Oh yes, that's the one that I want from um, Kelly. My daughter tried to steal it quite a few times. My four-year-old, she was three. At the time, she I have pictures of her wearing it and um, wanting to uh, take it to school. And actually, my fiancé told me I'm not allowed to sell it. He, he wants it if I don't want it. And uh, he was actually looking at buying. Oh, that must be nice. He, wants to, he wanted to buy Avalon one for, um, for school, but they're a little bit expensive. <laughs> and it's huge on her. Okay. Oh, it is right now. I it's eight eight p.m. Eastern. I'm in Ontario. I'm just in southwestern Ontario. I'm in a really small town. Um, okay, so here are the colors here. So I'm going to tell you the names of them. So this is called Bread and Butter Ballet Slippers. Sorry, guys. This is Tierra, that makes sense. And this is Tutu. And so this would be Sweet Nectar, and this is Toasted Almond. So what color do you think I should go? So even if we go one, one, two, three, four, five, six, what color should we do for the eyes? So there's four and one have been voted on. I'm thinking maybe keeping this one for the lip. I don't want this one. <laughs> uh, okay, so I, I'm seeing a lot of ones. So one in, one in, what did I say? How, how did I do this? One, two, yes, yeah, so one, three. So we'll start with this one. Yeah, I think we'll start with this one and then we'll see if it needs to be added. I might add this one as well, just to kind of give it a brightening effect. So thank you guys so much for participating in that. I mean, I, I, have, I have all the brushes basically out. My one jar of eye brushes. You guys are so awesome. If you guys can, if you guys can, just make sure you give the video a like. So I ordered the new Morphe. Um, pony palette because I had cashed in my scene points I should have like tried to open this beforehand oh my god um gosh sorry uh so I got the pony one and apparently it's shipping from out in BC and I got a notice today saying it may not sh it may not ship for a while because they're having issues which is of course you know it's no big deal like I'd rather you know People be safe and whatnot. Ooh, okay, so there it is. Oh, that is beautiful. Okay, so, but it's a little disappointing. And I also have the Jouer concealer and the new, um, I picked up a new, um, new color for this. So I'm gonna do that again with the concealer. And um, that'll be sometime hopefully next week. We'll see, let's see, okay. I'm kind of, I'm kind of nervous. Let's 
So, yeah. And for the Americans and um, people that are not here in Canada, if you don't know, BC is having... Um, <laughs> that is funny. Um, is a, a flooding, massive, massive, massive flooding. And uh, it has taken out part of the... Um, yeah, uh, it's taken out part of our major highway that actually connects from BC to Nova Scotia, I believe. Um, and it's the Trans-Canada Highway. Like a large portion has been taken out or it actually went onto Google Maps. And you can see how much of that is, you know, taken out. Now the airport is still working in Vancouver, which is crazy because it's between Vancouver and Kelowna. And, like, I've got some family out there. Like, they're okay. But, who? Oh. Yeah, it's crazy, 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 crazy. Unfortunately, I can't. I am broke until, like, I think next week. And even next week, I got to focus on Christmas. I got four kids. Aww. So my son turns 18 tomorrow. My oldest son. And the other one turns uh, turned 17 yesterday. So So I was hoping for a little bit more bling on this, but I mean, it's beautiful though, isn't it? And it, I'm like really, really thrilled with it. Um, yeah, so my boys are a year minus two days apart. So the older one turns 18 tomorrow and the younger one turned 17 yesterday. So um, it was an interesting time. Yes, thank you. And um, Monday, I didn't do a video Tuesday because I was still in a bit of shock. But my son got into a car accident because of the weather. Yeah, it's hard when it's this close. Look at that, guys. Whoa. Is, um, is that with bling? He's okay, yeah, he's okay. He's sore, still sore. That was Monday night. He called me in a panic to go pick him up. And uh, so I called my fiancé home because he works the afternoon shift. Ah, uh, And uh, he's home tonight. He had an appointment today. But, uh, yeah, and his, his um, my daughter came over to watch the little one while I went to go get him, but then... Uh, he ended up getting a ride from a friend, friend's dad, so. And then we also, in our small town, like our small town's only like 2,000 people, right? Um, tomorrow we have a Kris Kringle market, so there's like five food trucks. We don't have food trucks anywhere in this area. This Body is going to be at one of those five <laughs> brushes. Five, two, five brushes, five trucks. Oh, yes. Hi, Vanessa. I actually have a 19-year-old who's going to be 20 in April. So, yeah, and I'll be 40, actually, in February. So, I've been told that. Skin care, skin care, and make sure you wear sunscreen, people. That is my biggest thing. I really wish I wore sunscreen more than what I did when I was a kid, when I was a teenager. Okay, so I'm going to open up this tutu because I kind of want to see what it's like. Oh, my, I bet we're the same age. I say that like I'm all excited, but <laughs> parts of me are dreading it. I don't know why. I just, I don't know where my time has gone. Like,
<clears throat> okay, let's see here. Oh, look at it. I got it all over myself. Martine, you, I cannot believe that for a second, not for a single second, you do not, not look, no. Okay, here's the bright, bright pink. Are you guys ready for this? I've got this all over my hand. Let's see here. Neither was I. And I, and I was really lucky. I have to say that I was really lucky. I do have like some age spots coming in here. And um, no way, Andrew. No, I don't believe that either. Um, I got lucky. And they are fading with because I'm using the Doll 10 Overnight Serum. And they are starting to fade a little bit. But uh, yeah. You know, it's funny because when I started working at TG, I was 32 and I had three kids and they were pretty young. Yeah, about 10 and nobody believed me. That's crazy, guys. I don't know, what do you guys think so far? This pink is actually really nice. It's not as pink. Yes. Yeah. Well, I, it's Turner syndrome, is that like um, a medical issue? Cause I have one too, I have a few. And I have to say, because of my birthmark, I have uh, been forced to take care of my skin because I usually go for laser treatments. And they say the um, you have to keep on your... Um, I'm sorry, guys, you're crooked. I'm crooked. Uh, you have to make sure you do keep your, uh, your sunscreen on because the darker your skin, the more... Um... Zowie, that's crazy. That's absolutely crazy. Uh, yeah, the more the more sunscreen or the um, the lighter my skin is, the lighter uh, the the less that it'll absorb from um, the laser. So I won't have as much skin damage. So I definitely have to do freezing water. Oh, I have a hard time with that one. I do have it cold because I just turn on the top, but it's usually on the warm. Oh, I did not know that. Huh, I have to kind of look into that. I like learning about the people that I am in contact with because uh, I feel it makes me a better friend when I know what someone's going through. But, um, yeah, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, Andre, I swear, every time I look at your pictures, you're like 20. You don't have a wrinkle. Aw, how old's your little one there? Okay, so do you guys think that's enough for now or should I add more? I'm kind of liking it the way it is. Kind of want to add more gold though. I love this gold. I think it's very simple, which is kind of not me. As Andrea said the one time, she goes, I knew you weren't feeling well when you went for a neutral look. I just about fell out of bed laughing at that. I was like, how? Okay, you have me there. You do have me there. So I'm actually going to go. Oh, I have a four-year-old, so I know exactly. And I was there with the two and the three-year-old. Oh, my gosh. My boys. And then at Paige was four, and oh my gosh, she was she was a mini mom. She was really good. Um, I'm going to a food truck t <laughs> tomorrow in Canada. We had our uh, we have our Thanksgiving, 
back in um, October. I said, back. Look at me. Can you tell? So I'm actually using the Danessa Merrick's um, Beauty. This is a vision flush. Um, so did I. But then I kind of, I did say, I did kind of like, um, where is it here? Where's this pink one? So there's the brush. Like, I think if I, like, I could build this up a little bit. You can kind of see that it's getting brighter. She is. She's in bed right now. She's loving school. Like, she's so funny, though. They, uh, they did, um... I just talk, was talking to the teacher last night, and they're just loving her. Today was a little late picking her up, and you, you could see how sad she was. Because dad, dad had today off, so I said, well, usually I leave at this time. I go check the mail, and I go pick her up. And he's like, well, let's go to the grocery store. And I was like, oh, don't know if I have enough time, but okay. So just so you guys know, I use the, um, the Doll uh, Skin uh, Genius Tinted Skin Primer. So... Um, this is really nice because you can actually use it as a, just um, if I wanted to do a quick look, I could just take this and run with it. I wouldn't do obviously such a high um, coverage for the under eye area with it. Um, I think you said you got, let me see if I can find it here. Because I did want to just kind of go over that. There it is. Should be able to find it. So I think you got the Smooth Assist Retexturizing Fluid. Is that what you said you got, Andrea? I could actually use that tonight instead of the TSC, TCE. If you guys haven't, go check out the Doll 10's new brush. It's got like pink confetti sparkles on it and you can get it with the TCE for like 40 bucks, American. And I think you can still use my code. I'm not 100% sure. What are you, uh, my cat, my cat is being weird. She's climbing up into the, the attic. She likes heights. So this foundation will be great for you. So it's got a bit of um, serums. It's got serums in it too. No, it's a running joke with Doll 10. They're like, we were clean before clean was a thing. So they tend to use um, a, lot of pro um, a lot of stuff in their skincare that is made to nourish your skin. And they put it through everything. So you don't need just skincare. So you're getting your skincare plus uh, with them. This eyeshadow is the uh, Danessa Merricks. They have the trio for $40, and I was going to get it, but I was like, I don't know if I'm going to like it, right? So they had the concealer, too, and I was so mad because they didn't send it. So this isn't... Uh... And it's funny because somebody messaged me um, last or Monday night and was telling me that because you can create a better line going up. And I'm like, yeah, usually I do do it that way. But um, when I'm doing those videos, I want to be quick. And I don't want to take up a lot of time. So, yeah. So this one isn't as heavy as my um, TCE. But it's still gorgeous. You see? Like, it does not feel like I'm wearing a heavy heavy, 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 um, makeup. So, I'm going in with the overachiever. I want to get their new stuff. They've got a new one out and it's like a little brush and it's supposed to be for your hair and your, your brows. It is really neat.
It is. It really is. And I will say that one of the things that I really do enjoy about um, using this is that I don't, like, I put it on and I, um, I forget about it. Like, I would like scratching my skin. I'm like, oh, yeah, I've got this stuff on. Um, I don't know how I did that. I got cat hair in my... I guess I didn't do anything underneath and I could have. Well, I have to once my um, mascara is dried out. So this is the Effort Lash Extra, L uh, Extra EXL. I love the packaging. I have to admit, that's one of my favorite things about them. Okay, so I'm going to use... Okay, so I'm going to use this as the blush. Do, do, do. I'm kind of nervous about this part because it's like... Let's see. Ooh. That kind of just melted in there. Hello. <laughs> I don't know if you guys... I'm not sure. Let me just grab that. Whoop. A tiny amount to the lips and eyes or cheeks and blend. Layer product to build up the color to taste. Formula may be applied using your finger or brush or enclosed applicator. By the way, I'm guessing this is the applicator. Oh. I have been dealing with my neck. Um, I've always been into makeup. Um, I used to be heavily into Lancome. And then um, when I went on uh, maternity leave, I got taken off of work early, actually. Um, just pissing around on Facebook. And... and uh, I found that they had a box. I think I started with Julep with a nail subscription because my nails were so long and they were so gorgeous. So I did that and I just kind of took off from there. I got into every single, um, what do I want to say here? Uh, box you could think of I was into. Um, boxy charm into uh, just ipsy and fab fit fun and anything you could think of. So I'm gonna go in with that bright pink and see if uh, So, I mean, there is definitely color. I think if you don't, like, do, did what, did, do, do what I did by, like, kind of smushing it around, you can really get some color going. Lip monthly. How was it? Um... Uh... 
Oh, I can't even. I know which one you're talking about, too. And it ended up being a bit of a one of those ones, I think. gone quiet I know <laughs> when I think it's near my eye I have to be quiet for some reason I really feel like I could use this gold in my life like it is so gorgeous I'm putting more on thank you you know, I used to be one of those people that couldn't take a compliment to save my life. And now I'm like, you know what? I can take a compliment and I love to give them. I think that uh, this is really nice. I have to admit, it's not, it's barely there now, but I wonder what I do with it. There it is here. Let's see here. Really build it up. Woo. That is absolutely gorgeous. One of the things I noticed that on YouTube and the reason why I started was just because I found that not enough Canadians were in it and it was a lot of young people. So not what I was expecting from it. Like I knew it was going to be nice. And you know what? These little pots, they have quite a bit in them, right? Like I barely even touched that. So I could totally do a look tomorrow <clears throat> with them. Whoa. I really like these two colors. Might have to like go get those little plastic pots and put them in there and like so I can screw them shut so they don't dry out and then keep using them. Because they really are gorgeous. I'm going over to Listable tomorrow, so I may just do that. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm going to... Before I do my lips here, I just want to... So I am actually using the... Um, it's called the Refocusing Powder. And I find that this really sets the makeup for me. It feels like it really blurs. Like you can see how much I used it so far. Like I'm gonna be out of it. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Excuse me guys. And see, I have a hard time watching other people because I really pick up on other people's stuff. And then I'm always afraid I'm going to lose myself. So I have a hard time. I do try to watch some people. But... Okay, so... Let's, okay, let's see. I'm gonna use the same color for my cheeks for my lips.
So this isn't exactly dried, as you can see up here. So I'm gonna say, <clears throat> excuse me guys, sorry. This is really, really, really creamy. And it's so weird because I just put it on my lips and see how it's, it's dry, right? I don't know. You can kind of see some. I'm going to add the gold. I don't know what that was, but... No, it's not. Well, yeah, actually, I think it is. But it's hard to tell because it's reflecting so well. But it could be also this. <clears throat> it could be my eyeshadow primer. It's not. It is a little bit. Do you see right there from the eyeliner? So obviously, you just put the eyeliner on too thick. Yeah, see, on both sides, it's doing that. So just on the top. But it wasn't that hard to uh, take off, so that's good. Now let's see here. I like that, like, my brush doesn't feel wet. And there's no transfer, right? Like. Yeah, this is <clears throat> a lot better than I thought it was going to be. I'm definitely going to have to go to the dollar store and get, like, little things and just kind of transfer them into them because I'll, like, lose these. Definitely would. I'm wondering. We use the elf one today. It's super shiny, which I don't want to lose, but oh, did that just Yeah. Kind of took took down the shininess a bit. But here. Let's Oops. Oh, come on. There we go. But I'm not really going out anywhere, so it's not a big deal. But if I was, I would definitely be playing around with this. Now, I didn't look up any t tips or tricks for this because I want it to be an amateur experience at the best because I think that most makeup... You have to try first yourself and then go look up other people's way of doing it so that you can see where you went wrong. Because sometimes when you think you're doing something wrong and it works, it's really, you know what I mean? It's not wrong. It's just, you know, a different way. And sometimes the right way doesn't always work for everybody. That's one thing I have noticed. Like there's certain things that I cannot do no matter what that I've watched tutorials on and I still just don't understand it. Like wings, I still don't understand it. I still don't understand it. But for me, I need to tr keep trying and trying and trying be before I can do it. It's the actual physical of doing that gets me to understand it. I don't know if that makes any sense. But I think putting the translucent powder down has helped it. So just gonna, it's going to take a minute to kind of 
But that gold is so pretty. Now this is pretty dry. Put it into mine and then mold it. I do have very hooded eyes. Like, I wake up and my eye, this part of my eye, you can't even see this part of my eye. I'm so like, I did look up some hooded, um, hooded, tr hooded eye tricks, like uh, how to do like a cut crease and stuff. I still have a hard time with it, but I think I've gotten better with it and better with each application. So tonight I didn't do any of that. Usually I would like have all makeup all the way out to here. And, but that's how I like to have my makeup. Hi, Sheba. Hey, it's okay to be late. Especially in the winter time. Okay, so I do have the name wheel all set up. And I'll just put those brushes there. Oh, these things, I have to hide these. My cat that just climbed up into the, the rafter there, she likes to eat them on me. Eat them. I definitely think I need to play with this more, but just this application, I think it's so pretty. But the thing is, is that, like, look how huge these things are. And you don't need a lot. Like, you would just take one dab and it would do both eyes. Like, the, these are going to last me, like, months. <laughs> I have two, and what's funny, the one today decided to fall off where he was sleeping, and I'm like, and he fell off of it yesterday, too. So it's not like his first day falling off things. I'm like, seriously, what is wrong with you? Okay, let's, sorry, I'm just trying to get my... Don't use this. It has to make my, it's way to the garbage. All right, so I got my iPad here, my super old but trusty iPad. Okay, so as you guys can see, there's the names. So I have the box of skincare set aside someplace. I can't even remember where I put it, but oh, there it is. I say that it's, nope, that's not. One of these days I'll be okay for, I put things where I need to. There it is, right there. That is full. That's like five or six pounds. So I'm going to say this now. Wherever it goes, there has been massive shipping delays on everything. So if it stays here in Canada, in Ontario, it may not be affected. But if it has to go to BC or any way out that way, just have some patience. Um, I asked if I was going to do uh, international. And I normally, I probably would try but right now it has to go by boat and we know that the port in um, the US and now Canada is going to be completely backed up. So you wouldn't be able to get this for months and months. And with it being skincare, I just don't think that it's safe to travel that far, especially in the winter because it's going to freeze, it's going to thaw, it's going to freeze, it's going to thaw. And at that point, it just it's breaking down. So I just do not feel comfortable with that. So I apologize now and I did put in my new video. So if you guys watch my video from Monday, I do have two giveaways. And if I get 50 different people entering, I'll do both of them. If not, I'll just do one and then put the next one on for the next time. And I'll do that. I'll do it live again in two weeks if you guys would like that on a Wednesday night again. And uh, yeah, um, I'll announce the winners for that. This is dried down to be like a, what is that? Um, a liquid lip, but not quite. It's kind of stayed where I put it too. All right, are we ready? Like this, 
the chat has gone extremely quiet. <laughs> so I hope you guys are ready. <laughs> Jessica P. Okay, so um, I'm going to... Let's see here. Let's see if I can screenshot this. Um, I haven't used, I don't use my iPad for very much. I won it so long ago that, nope, nope, that just turns it off. Okay. Anyway, I'll take a picture of that later. Congratulations to Jessica. I don't think she's here on the live with us, but I'll go put a message under her name on the video. And then, um, if she doesn't claim it, I will do another I'll give her to my next live to get a hold of me. If not, the next live, I'll do another giveaway and I'll, I'll draw another name is what I'm going to say. <laughs> say. Um, are you guys okay with coming back in two weeks or do you guys want to do another one like next week maybe? I am getting in. Um, I do. Um, I don't know if you guys follow Sincerely LGS. Uh, Lisa there she did uh, she got the same email that I did I just forgot about mine um, and she got skincare from Stylevania Stylevania Vanna. Um, I did as well but I chose makeup so I'm gonna do a look with it so I was thinking about maybe doing that uh, I do have to do a video and then um, I can do a live maybe and try the d makeup I'm actually getting like a full face I'm getting primer foundation mascara eyeliner i am uh, uh yeah i've absolutely i just didn't want to bore you guys so if you guys are up for it i would love it it actually gives me something to look forward to during the week i get all anxious and then i get like super excited about it so absolutely i can do it even if it's only half an hour that's fine as long as my daughter's down and she's good to go um sometimes she does like to sing for about an hour an hour and a half so you will probably hear that but um yeah so uh, yes and actually i have another surprise coming that i can't tell you guys about until i get it because i'm afraid i'm going to tell you and then it's not going to happen so yeah um guys if you buy anything from doll 10 there is a link in the description of all my videos that will take you actually to my landing page and um i'm really trying to get on their pr list and if you guys go ahead follow them on instagram and try to win that hundred dollar prize you can tag me in that because they usually do two people um i would love to win with you um but yes if you have any of your friends that are looking to buy from um doll 10 tell them my code give them the link anything would greatly help me i'm super uh, pumped about this um this brand um and I'm so excited. And I do try other brands. You guys know that. I have the Jouer foundation and concealer coming in. That's another brand that I heard that does really well with covering up um, facial birthmarks. Um, and as you guys can see, I do like my Jeffree Star stuff. So maybe I can do a look with that. Not next week, but in a couple of weeks. Um, but yeah, so... Uh, but yeah, this is this is a brand that I have really grown attached to. Um, but anyway, yes, I think that's it, guys. I think that's it. So yeah, next week will just be a simple live. Um, thank you, Andrea. It's been it's it's been a travel. I actually was thinking about quitting a couple of weeks ago. I was just so fed up. I wasn't getting anywhere. I wasn't doing anything. And then I thought, you know what? I need just to work a little bit harder prove what I am who I am and why I want to do this because they can't just people can't just give away freebies for nothing right they they need to know that you're in it to help them as well so yeah um yes and hopefully I'll have some new stuff next week maybe I'll get the new Morphe uh, pony um palette and the new makeup too I'll try to save that for the uh for the um Wednesday if I can I and with winter coming I figure it's nice to have a mid mid midweek break something to do so okay so we'll meet here next week next same time and we'll do a look hopefully I have some new makeup 
for you guys. Uh, if not, we'll just go through some old stuff. Okay, guys, thank you so much for joining me. Congratulations to Jessica for winning the skincare. And again, if we don't hear back from her, I'll just do another draw in two weeks, okay? Bye, guys.